Being named as an All-Australian is one of the highest honours of our game as it represents a player's outstanding and consistent performance across an entire season. This year, in a season like no other, the champions of our game have stood up and dominated in their respective positions on the field week in and week out. To announce this year's AFL All-Australian team, please welcome two-time All-Australian and member of the All-Australian selection panel, Glenn Jakovic. Thank you, Sarah. The defenders of the 2023 All-Australian team. The back pocket, James Cicely Hawthorne. Full back, Callum Wilkie, St Kilda. Back pocket, Tom Stewart, Geelong. Half-back flank, Jack Sinclair, St Kilda. Centre-half back, Darcy Moore, Collingwood. Half-back flank, Dan Houston, Port Adelaide. Sicily dons his first All-Australian blazer in what has been an outstanding year for the Hawks skipper. Sicily is ranked second in the league for intercept possessions, consistently turning defence into attack. Sicily for intercept mark 10, equaling the all-time record. And stamping his authority as one of the competition's elite defenders. Callum Wilkie also debuts in the team of the year after an impressive season down back for the Saints. Rated elite for kicks, averaging 14 per outing, he's also a model of consistency, not missing a game since debuting in 2019. Wilkie's use of the body in the contest was fantastic. Geelong's Tom Stewart has become Chris Scott's Mr Fix-It and the source of many headaches for opposition coaches. Stewart not often a goal kicker. He tumbles it long. He tumbles it straight. Stewart has had several standout performances this year, rated elite in kicks, marks and metres gained. This is his fifth All-Australian blazer. Jack Sinclair made his All-Australian debut last year and backs it up in 2023, following another outstanding season. Knocks to Sinclair, who bends it to perfection. Sinclair's calm presence coming out of defence, combined with his elite ball use and decision making, are big reasons why he's the number one rated defender in the competition. Captaincy agreed with Darcy Moore, who took his game to another level in a career best season. Darcy Moore through the pain. He topped the league in intercept marks and rarely lost a one-on-one -on -one contest. Moore also provided plenty of drive from defence with his run and quality ball use. Port Adelaide's Dan Houston makes his All-Australian debut. Ranked the second best general defender in the competition, his beautiful right boot, exceptional decision making and intercepting capabilities make him an absolute weapon in all facets for the power. The greatest of escapes and the most magnificent after the siren goal. The midfield of the 2023 All-Australian team. On the wing, Josh Dacos, Collingwood. Centre, Marcus Bondapelli, Western Bulldogs. And on the wing, Errol Goulden, Sydney Swans. In the ruck, Tim English, the Western Bulldogs. Ruck Rover, Zach Butters, Port Adelaide. And ruck, Nick Dacos, Collingwood Football Club. Josh Dacos has had a career best year on the wing. A beautiful kick on both feet, Josh covers a huge amount of ground with his two-way running. Josh Dacos from 55. Your beauty! His ability to break lines alongside his classy ball use has seen him become a critical ingredient in this Magpie side bound for September. 
Pulling on his fifth All-Australian blazer, Marcus Bontepelli's influence on games this year was extraordinary. Bulldogs captain led from the front through his ability to win the ball in the contest or on the outside, as well as hitting the scoreboard. He can do it all. He is an outright superstar of the competition. Sydney young gun Errol Goulden receives his first All-Australian selection. Goulden has become an elite winger in just his third AFL season. He's ranked number one in the competition for metres gained and often split open opposition defences with his elite kicking inside 50. Gets onto his left, can he finish? Bang! The 2023 All-Australian Ruckman is Tim English. The 26-year-old Bulldog has impressed all through not only his ruck work, but ability to influence the game around the ground and hit the scoreboard. This is his first All-Australian Blazer. You can see the task for him here, which he handles beautifully. Zach Butters has had a breakout season in Port Adelaide's midfield, which sees him earn his first All-Australian selection. Butters over his head towards goal! Zach Butters! Brave, tough and skillful, Butters wins the ball in contests and regularly sets up scoring opportunities for teammates. His outstanding finish to the season has him looking primed for a huge September. It's little surprise to see Nick Dacos awarded his first All-Australian selection. What a dominant season from a second-year player. Dacos has mesmerised the opposition with his elite ball use by hand and foot, showing great poise and decision-making under pressure. Oh, my goodness. Has he got an air of greatness or what? A freakish talent, Dacos has quickly become a generational player. The forwards of the 2023 All-Australian team. Forward flank, Connor Rosie, Port Adelaide. Centre half forward, Taylor Walker, Adelaide. Forward flank, Christian Petrarca, Melbourne. Forward pocket, Charlie Cameron, Brisbane Lions. Full forward, Charlie Kurnow, Carlton. Forward pocket, Toby Green, GWS Giants. Connor Rosie lines up on the half-forward flank and transitions from the bench last year into the starting 22. Ranked elite for score involvements, Rosie has become a devastating player in the competition with his slick, classy ball use and excellent decision-making. Kick one of the goals of the year! At centre-half forward is Adelaide veteran Taylor Walker. Astonishingly, Walker wins his first All-Australian Blazer in his 16th season. And the result will delight the crowd. Tex kicked a career-best 76 goals and lit up the Crows' forward line with his strong marking and superb kicking. A popular and well-deserved selection at age 33. It was another outstanding season from Melbourne's Christian Petrarca. Ranked number one in the competition for score involvements, his combination of brute force, elite skills and supreme work rate sees Petrarca secure his fourth All-Australian Blazer. It's a back-to-back goals for the Ds. Petrarca's got it. In the forward pocket and gaining his second All-Australian selection is Brisbane's leading goal kicker, Charlie Cameron. The fan favourite kicked 53 goals and was a headache for defenders with his blistering pace, elite pressure and constant goal threat. Did he get a toe on that? Oh, that it would be. be a miracle goal from Charlie. At full forward, Charlie Curnow makes a back-to-back All-Australian selections. This year's Coleman medalist produced a career-best haul of 78 goals, propelling the Blues to their first finals appearance since 2013 and Charlie to superstar status. Standing there, Charlie! Oh, of course it is! Giant skipper Toby Green adds a third All-Australian blazer to his collection. Green kicked a career-high 60 goals and tore apart opposition defences with his elite aerial and ground ball work. There's no surprise he was rated the number one small forward in the game. Toby did get enough on it! He did! The Green Machine!
the interchange of the 2023 All-Australian team. Caleb Sarong, Fremantle. Zach Merritt, Essendon. Jordan Dawson, Adelaide. And Nick Larkey, North Melbourne. On the interchange is Fremantle's Caleb Sarong. The 22-year-old hurt opposition teams with his disposals, contested ball and clearance work. Sarong's rapid rise to stardom deserves recognition with back-to-back -back All Australian Blazers. Can he find that left boot of his and kick the goal? Yes, sir! Alongside him is Zach Merritt. The Essendon captain has been eye-catching in the middle with his elite disposal and decision-making. His huge work rate and determination has seen him become an important leader in a young developing team. This is his third All-Australian selection. Might just kick a goal! Wow! Jordan Dawson is richly deserving of his debut selection in the All-Australian team. Dawson set up many scoring opportunities with his elite marking skills, determined running and devastating left foot kick. And he does it and enjoys it! The captain's move to the midfield has been a huge reason for the Crows' surge up the ladder. Rounding out the interchange and making his All-Australian debut is Nick Larkey. The Kangaroo spearhead kicked a remarkable 71 goals in a team that only won three games. He's strong, Larkey! He was just too tough in the clinches! He showed a great ability to work hard up and down the ground, strong hands in the air and arrow-light accuracy in front of goal. The umpires of the 2023 All-Australian team. Field, Robert Finlay. Boundary, Matthew Konechka. Goal, Adam Wojak. Field umpire Robert Finlay has officiated 327 games and 12 finals. Matthew Konetska has run the boundary in 261 games and 29 finals. Adam Wojcik has been goal umpire for 292 games and 32 finals, including four grand finals. Everyone, please put your hands together for the 2023 AFL All-Australian team. To announce the vice captain and captain of this year's All-Australian team, please welcome CEO of the AFL, Gillan McLaughlin. Thank you, Sarah, and the 2023 All-Australian Vice-Captain is Marcus Bondabelli of the Western Bulldogs. And the 2023 All-Australian Captain is Toby Green of the GWS Giants. Marcus and Toby, let's now take a look at the overall team. From the back line, the talents of Sicily, Wilkie and Stewart. Just try getting past the half-backs, Sinclair, Moore and Houston. The midfield is star-studded, Josh Dacos, Bontempelli and Goulden. The half-forward line are brilliant and brave, Rosie, Walker and Petrarca. And we have goals galore in the forward line, Cameron, Kerno, and Green. Congratulations to the followers, English, Butters, and Nick Dacos. And rounding out this exceptional team, Sarong, Merritt, Dawson, and Larkey.